joy, 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 joy down in my heart Where? Down in my heart to stay And I'm so happy, so very happy I've got the love of Jesus in my heart down in my heart And I'm so happy, so very happy I've got the love of Jesus in my heart What else you got? I've got the peace that passes understanding down in my heart Where? Down in Understanding down in my heart Where? Down in my heart to stay And I'm so happy, so very happy I've got the love of Jesus in my heart Down in my heart And I'm so happy, so very happy I've got the love of Jesus in my heart I've got the wonderful love of my blessed reading Away down in the depths of my heart Where? Down in the depths of my heart Where? Down in the depths of my heart I've got the wonderful love of my blessed reading Away down in the depths of my heart Where? Son of God, give me J, give me E, give me S, give me U, and another S. Woo! Give me Jesus, give me Jesus, give me Jesus, the Son of God. Give me J, give me E, give me S. Give me you and another S. Woo! Good morning, boys and girls. How are you doing this morning? We welcome you to our, old, our Sunday school service online. I hope you're ready because today you can see we have a very beautiful thing in front of us. So there's a surprise coming. And before we start anything, let us pray. Father God Almighty, we come before thy holy throne. We thank you for the gift of life and health. We thank you for being with us throughout the week that is just ended when we were in school, Lord. Now I pray that as we hear your word, that Lord, you're going to, uh, to refresh us and we're going to learn and we're going to have a good time as we learn your word. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. So kids, who can you see here? Yes, what you can see is we have someone who's new. And I'm going to let them tell you who they are. Hello, boys and girls. How are you? It is my hope that you're doing fine back at home. And my hope also that you've had a lovely week. And uh, if you've had a lovely week, kindly shout amen. 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 We thank God for his grace. Indeed, it is the Lord who has brought us this far. And it is the Lord who is still with us even in this service. My name is John Nyoro Njoroge. I hope you got that right. John Nyoro Njoroge. And I'm born again. And I'm delighted to be here with our lovely teachers. Can we let us clap for them? Amen. And I'm new in this church. And I'll be with you, and you can also call me Teacher John now, now that I've joined you, and I know that God is going to bless us. I'm here as a sub-deacon. Again, I hope you got that right, sub-deacon. And I know that the Lord will guide us all through. Thank you, Teacher Angela. May God bless you. Thank you so much. Children, what do we tell our new teacher? Jesus loves you and me and all of us. Hallelujah, praise the Lord. And now I'm going to introduce Uncle Dan. Do you love Uncle Dan? Do you, do you love Uncle Dan? If you love Uncle Dan, don't say it. Yes, let's welcome him. Uncle Dan, take over. Hello, hello. Thank you, Chanji, for introducing us for the lovely song. We love you all. Do you intro Guys, 
Do you love our new teacher? To say me? How many love our new teacher? Sema? If you love our new teacher, clap once. If you love our new teacher, clap twice. If you love our new teacher, clap three times. Now, boys and girls, first of all, do you have your Bibles? If you have your Bible, try your Bible and wake your mommy, wake your daddy as we listen to the Word of God. Remember, we should always read the Word of God as Jesus always tells us, and the Bible tells us we should always be informed in the Word of God. Today, we are going to read and to learn from one good story of a boy in the Bible, of a kid in the Bible. So, you know, children of God, will you sing hallelujah? Yes. Children of God, will you sing hallelujah? Yes. Sing hallelujah three times. Hallelujah, 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 hallelujah. No, one day, Jesus was walking alikuwa ametoka a place called Galilee. And uh, akafika mahali, he was tired and others people were tired. Ushikuwa tired? How do you feel? Before that, have you ever gone to school without a snack and someone gave you? How did you feel? The time that ulipatua that good snack by your friend, ulisikia aje? Ulikuwa mkona nja alafu patane na mtu, a good friend of yours, akupatia gift. How will you feel? Now Jesus alikuwa ametoka ku preach and now each and every other person was following him because they knew that Jesus was doing amazing things Jesus was doing a great work healing the sick those who are blind he was healing them and they were able to see the lepers waliweza kutembea Now akafika mahali then he asked he asked one of the disciples called Philip these people are tired, they are very hungry, but they don't have something to eat. Where are we going to get something for them to eat? Then Andrew, the brother of Simon Peter, a Kamskia, then he came and said, you know what? Jesus, there's a one boy, little boy, when you are going to five loaves of bread. Sema, five loaves of bread? Five loaves of bread. Yes, let's count loaves of bread. One. Two, three, four, five. Then Andrew akaletea Jesus akamwambia, this kid, this boy has five loaves of bread. Kama ni unge patia Jesus. Unge mpatia na uliko mepatia ongo na mama yako. Your favorite, to say me, your favorite food. Unge mpatia. Now, the boy gave the five loaves of bread and two fish to Jesus. Then Jesus gave thanks to God Akasema, thank you for the food that you are about to eat. Do you give thanks when you are about to eat? We should all give thanks for what God has given us. So Jesus gave thanks to God and the loaves of bread multiplied and he shared with the rest. So Jesus shared with the rest as we share and also the two fish they multiplied. Then over 5,000 people were fed by Jesus. Do you see? God loves us when we are sharing. The story, we get it from the Holy Book of from the Holy Book of God, from the Gospel of God, that is from the book of John chapter 1, uh, chapter 6 from verse 1 to 13. John chapter 1, uh, chapter 6, John chapter 6 from that one, from verse 1 to verse 13. That's where we find the story of Jesus feeding the over 5,000 men. The story teaches us we should always share what we have with those who don't have. Do you share what you have with those who don't have? Do you share your small dollies with those who don't have? I'm a una semanga, all these are mine. Do you share? And people will always feel good. If you have more sweets, you should always share with them. Okay? So, and God will, is always happy when we are sharing with others. And our memory verse will come from the book of Hebrews. Sema Hebrew. Hebrews. 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 Hebrews chapter 13 verse 16. Hebrews chapter 13 verse 16. Sema Hebrews 13 16. Hebrews 13 16. Hebrews 13 16. Hebrews 13 16. It says. It says. Do not forget to go to do good. Do not forget to do good. 
or share with others. Or share with others. Do not forget to do good things. Do not forget to do good things. Or share with others. Or share with others. Let's repeat Hebrews thirteen sixteen. Hebrews thirteen sixteen. It says. It says. Do not forget to do good. Do not forget to do good. Or share with others. Or share with others. Do not forget to do good. Do not forget to do good. Or share with others. Or with Whether is that whatever you have, okay, on a pencil, Billy and your friend Hannah, share with them. Okay? Come up on a sanitizer at school and your neighbor Hannah, tell them, take a little. We avoid corona. You share with others, even the small sanitizers that you have at, at school. Okay? But don't share your mask. Don't share your mask. Don't share your mask. But share food that you have extra. Share your pencil, clothes, shoes that you have with those who don't have. And God will bless you. Okay? Yes. Our memory verse was from the book of Hebrews chapter 6. Hebrews 13, 16. Hebrews 13, 16 says, Do not forget to do good or share with others. Do not forget to do good or share with others. May God bless you. And before that, Let's pray. When you want to pray, when we want to pray, we close our eyes, we put our hands together, then we start to pray. Thank you, God, for teaching us how to share and telling us that we should share with those who don't have. Teach me as a kid to share with those who don't have. As a boy in the Bible, shared food and that fed over 5,000 men. Continue to protect me, to protect my parents, to protect my siblings, and me when I'm in school. Thank you. In Jesus' name, we pray and give thanks. We all say, Amen. Goodbye, boys and girls. Continue to take care of yourselves. Kumbuka kuna corona. Wash your hands, sanitize, keep distance, and always remember to wear your mask. Always remember to wear your mask. Goodbye, and we love you so much. <laughs>